saying goodbye, friends and family bill an emotional farewell to a pair of local National Guard units heading to Iraq. Groups we spoke to have one goal in mind. Just looking to get the mission done and, you know, get come back safely to my family and friends. Just about everyone staying in this building uh, has been deployed a couple times. And, uh, it's tough, but we want to get there, get our mission done, and, and get right back. This isn't the first time loved ones have had to wish these soldiers a safe return home. This will be their second tour of duty for both units. Iowa to Sue's reporter, Nicola Stefan, was at today's event, and she joins us now with our top local story. We found out in the 10 years since 9-11, more than 5,500 Rhode Island National Guard troops have answered the call, many of them more than once. Now dozens more are on their way overseas. The sounds of pride, the color of hope, faces on the verge of a difficult mission. I wish you Godspeed, the best of luck, stay, faith, stay safe, you are the best trained, well-led army in the world. Words of encouragement for about 20 National Guard troops who will step onto a battlefield thousands of miles away. Friday's ceremony was filled with support for the two units that will deploy to Iraq for one year. They will provide aviation support for combat and reconstruction operations. We pretty much uh, got all the everything together as far as our training and uh, we got a lot of good guys, um, a lot of new people too and uh, I think we can take it to the next step. A Company 1st Battalion 126th Aviation and D Company 126th Aviation are focused on a tough mission and an emotional goodbye. Missing family and friends. You know, it's going to be it's going to be real tough being away from them. You don't have to ask these soldiers if it's hard. It's on the faces of their loved ones. Those left behind tell us they will rely on each other. So we all just kind of put an arm around each other and that's what you have to do. Even before these troops leave, there's only one thing on the minds of those that love them. To have him home safe, that's it, that's all I want. All of them home safe. The troops will first deploy to Fort Hood, Texas before moving on to their mission in Iraq. With the Mobile Newsroom, Nicole Estefan, Eyewitness News.